Hello, I'm Jerry Ford. We got old Jeremy Ford over here. We're gonna do a review of an energy drink. This is uh, one that we have not heard of until just recently. Found these at uh, Big Lots. Uh, it's called Capoya, and got this for 33 cents. It's 16 fluid ounce can, so I mean, it's a that's a pretty good deal. I mean, it's a mango passion fruit. Um, five calories, zero sugar, no taurine, um, says it's premium, um, manufactured in the USA, has a little, a little deal back here, it says, developed as a premium peak performance drink. Capoya is known for their unique and original flavors. Unlike other energy drinks, Capoya is sugar free and features no taurine and essential B vitamins, allowing you to perform at peak levels. Whether you are using Capoya to compete, practice, play, or just increase your energy, when you hit the afternoon wall, grab an ice cold Capoya and feel the kick. I'd rather block that kick myself. I've been kicked before and it's not fun, so I'd probably block it and then I would return the kick, maybe a roundhouse or something. But, uh, Jeremy knows. <laughs> Don't think you'll be doing any roundhouse kicks anytime soon. Not at my age anymore. Probably not. I already got a groin pull. Okay, so carbonated water, citric acid, natural flavors, caffeine. Let's see, 80 milligrams of caffeine, ginseng root, guarana seed, glycerol ester of wood rosin different stuff like that mm -hmm. okay mm -hmm. all right let's see what we got here looks like mango or cantaloupe or something that kind of color orangish Okay. It's got a little haziness to it. It looks a little carbon. Ooh. Smell that? Mm -hmm. Has a little bit of a grapefruit or something going on. Passion fruit. Probably. Passion fruit, kind of? Mm -hmm. Yeah, it's just got a whole. I mean, it's got mango, passion fruit. It's got a little bit of aroma of, of um, kind of a grapefruit, kind of a bitter type aroma. Mm -hmm. it smells really good. Almost has a little salt saltiness to it. That's really good. Mm -hmm. It's got that what you would do to like cantaloupe or some kind of fruit. Just put a little bit of, of salt on it. Um, kind of has that kind of effect to it. Getting that little bit of a dry grapefruit kind of taste in there, mm -hmm. along with the sweet mango, mm -hmm. and then. The other f different fruit kind of flavor would be that passion fruit, I'm assuming. Mm. Very good though. Mm -hmm. But it does have a dry, on the dryness on the back end, doesn't it? Kind of a yeah. little bit of that. But it's very good, very drinkable. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> very light carbonation. Mm. It's kind of like a smooth juice type effect to it. It is kind of a a juiciness to it. Because no like carbonation burn or anything. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. All right. Very good. Mm -hmm. I like it. Uh, all right. And we needed that because uh, we're getting ready to do some work around the house. Need a little bit of a boost.
Mm -hmm. All right, well, let us know if you have had a Capoya energy drink. They don't appear to be very popular right now yet. I don't know, maybe they haven't been introduced very much. I haven't seen any commercials on them or anything like that. Or Have we even looked to see if they have any reviews on this yet? I'll have to check and see. Anyway, there you go. 33 cents for a pretty decent energy drink right there. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> okay. You got any more to say about it, Jeremy? I don't think so. Has a very, very light, like a tangerine sour, doesn't it? Mm -hmm. Just a little bit. Mm -hmm. Very good. Light to medium body. I keep thinking of things that I'm getting out of it. Mm -hmm. <clears throat> all right. Well, we'll end it there. Thank you all for watching. We appreciate it. See you on the next one.